Hey everyone and welcome back to Knowing Nuclear. So today this is our first video on a new series called Isotopes for Society. So if you're like me, you might hear the words radiation, nuclear, atomic, and you get all scared and freaked out because the things that first pop into your mind are these, Godzilla atomic bombs. So I'll just put your mind at ease. We're not going to be talking about this today. Nuclear is so much more than these, so we'll go ahead get rid of them. Not going to talk about this. However, there are a lot of really cool and really interesting ways that we use isotopes in society every single day. You may not know about them, which is why you're here. It's very exciting. So, some examples of ways that isotopes are used every single day in our society in a very safe and effective way, we're going to start out with radioactive dating. This is a technique that we can use to tell us how old something is, be it a dinosaur fossil or even just an ancient human fire pit. We can use different isotopes and their decays to tell us how old something, some, how old something is. Really cool, really interesting. Next, we can use stable isotopes to model the paleoclimate. So this means basically we can use ice cores and the stable isotopes that are trapped within the ice to tell us what the temperature was at a certain point in time. These can go up to like over 100,000 years ago to tell us how the climate today compares to how the climate was then. So it's very useful for us right now. Next, did you know that there are isotopes used in the smoke detectors in your house? It's true. Not only are they used in a safe and effective way, but they help to keep you safe as well. So we like these a lot. Next, they are used a lot in the medical sector. They are used for diagnostic imaging procedures as well as treatment purposes. And the last thing that we'll be talking about in this series is using isotopes to track the emissions from the transportation sector. And we're going to expand on each of these topics in another video within this series, and I hope you stay tuned to watch them.